Hey, I just got word that my man Jamie Foxx is about to fake his death, get all this money, royalties and everything from his movies, and uh, send out a clone. He, do, he decided if he, if he want to get cloned and that's like, I hope he's not sick, man. I hope he's not sick. I hope it is a, you know, stunt or whatever, but because what's going on? Why nobody usually they tell you what, you know, I mean, we can't, you know, everybody don't want to know. It's none of our business, and, you know, if it's something that he don't want nobody to know, but. But uh, I hope he all right, man. Hopefully it's just, um, you know, hopefully nobody don't know too much. No, no details. Nobody ain't giving no details. So it makes it, it makes it look even more suspicious. Because people want to be able to pray on what he got, and they want to, you know, they want to put him in the prayers. They want to know exactly what's going on with him. But you can still pray for him without knowing exactly the details. But whatever going on, hopefully it's just a regular sickness. But hopefully nothing. He's not involved in nothing. Or this is ain't no elite ritual, Illuminati ritual, or whatever they want to call it. Hopefully nobody after him, like the rumors say. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully the brother just, just you know, ate a bad sandwich or ate some bad pistachios or something. But hopefully nobody tried to delete him like they saying, uh, like the rumors are. Hopefully he's not getting cloned or or uh, anything like that. Uh, at the worst, at the worst, we hope that he fake his death. At the worst, we hope that he fake it. He's a good actor. At the worst, that's what we hope. At the worst, you know what I'm saying? We don't, uh, at the worst, you know, we hope that. So, that's just how it go, man. We'll see what happens. A lot going on in that world that most people are trying to get into because of the lights, camera, action. But a lot of people don't really want... You'd be surprised what you don't want once you get it, you know? A lot of people think they're going to be happy when they go in the NBA, when they get this money in this big house. You got a lot of fake people that's going to come around. And, uh, and then when you're in the entertainment, that's a whole nother world. Because then you got these gigs you want. And depending on if, you know, you want that gig and how much they're going to give you in that gig. And they're telling you they want you to do this. They want you to do that. It's not a good look. It's not a good look, man. So... Some people are doing it with no problem. Other people, they don't have a problem doing, some people don't have a problem doing whatever it takes to get to the artificial top. A lot of people are selling their soul in different ways. When you, anytime you exchange your happiness for wealth, that's a form of selling your soul. Anytime you exchange your happiness for wealth, that's a form of, of uh that's a form of uh that's a form of selling your soul anytime you're exchanging your happiness for wealth so don't do that man i don't care what it is i don't care if it's what it is do not exchange your happiness for wealth you know what i'm saying because at the end of the day stress kills and you can lose yourself exchanging your happiness for wealth. You can lose yourself. You don't want to lose yourself, you know? So, I'm Alan Ray, and stay prayed up in Jesus' name. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Um, like, subscribe, hit the bell. Subscribe to my other YouTube channel in the description box. Follow me on Instagram at Alan Ray, and then show. Instagram is also in the description box. If you want consultation, you want the um, latest technique on how to be a magnet, magnet to beautiful women. Uh, if you want consultation, if you want my latest book passage, uh, holler at me. And uh, 
on my Instagram. All right, much love to you. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. Speaking tongues, I'm out.